Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, The Kids, me, and I am back again with another video. I am so excited about how good my curls look with this style. Yes, you guys, I'm going to be showing you how I typically do my high puffs when I do wear my natural hair. As y'all know, I'm always protective styling. So what you see here is I already washed and conditioned my hair. This is what my hair looks like with absolutely no products in them. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you some products from Lotta Body. This is their Milk and Honey line. They have two new products. One is Elongate Me Curl Stretcher, and the other one is going to be a gel now the gel is the hold me down maximum hold styling gel it has maximum hold it enhances the curls and add more defined styling as well as moisture and shine a curl stretcher it is a light hold it elongates and strengthens curls and make the curls more uniform they are alcohol free and they're non drying so I'm going to go in first with the curl stretcher as you can see I use a generous amount I do have a low porosity hair and with low porosity hair, my hair usually tends to have product buildup. So I was definitely um, anxious to see how this, these products were going to work on my hair. And you'll see without the video, you'll see throughout the video exactly how my hair reacted to them. So again, my hair didn't have any products on it and that was the product that I went in with. Then after that, I'm gonna go in and I'm going to add the gel around my edges, just in general around the perimeter of my hair because again, I wanted to do a high puff. And so I went ahead and I took an elastic band and this is one of the stretchy elastic bands. I went ahead and I tied it on the back and I pretty much just pushed it up from my forehead area up and I positioned it to where I wanted my puff to lay. that you of course you want to get the edges right and for them to lay like you want them to lay you definitely need an edge brush so girl you need to get you one and I'm gonna be using this this scarf that I got from Lottie Body as well love me a good silk scarf and I'm going to go in and start defining my curls now when I define my curls I did just use the gel only of course because it's already product inside of my hair so that's why you see so much of the the white product on my hair um, is because I had just my hair is wet with the product inside of it with my hair being wet is going to look white So I'm just going to take my hair and this is going to take a lot of upper strength Because I'm taking literally piece by piece of my hair and I'm doing the shingle method Which means that I'm just taking a small piece medium sized piece <laughs> as you can see I'm just grabbing and going and I'm just going to twist it around my finger so I'm just gonna put the gel on it and then twist it around my finger and it took me about I want to say 35 minutes to do this method but y'all the results are literally flawless so I definitely think that doing it this way is so much better than actually grabbing your dimming brush and just running your brush through your curls because this way it gives you more uniform and it gives you more defined a more defined look so i love yeah i love this method better uh, than doing it the way that i had always been doing it anyway did let my hair air dry after I got done so this is it still wet I let it air dry for maybe like I want to say two to three hours and then this is the final result as you can see when I take this silk scarf off girl yes the edges are laid and slayed and my curls are popping like what name a better combination for a natural hair girl I'll wait <laughs> I absolutely love it but of course you can't leave it there so I took my pick and I'm just going to go ahead and pick the hair now as you can see I'm usually most people will start from the roots but I like to start um, down 
not on the ends of my hair, but a little lower um, than the roots to try to pick that part first. And then I go to the roots to give it more height. So you definitely don't want to skip this step. Well, I guess you can skip, skip this step if you don't want your puff to be too large, but I like for mine to sit on my head and I like for it to, you know, have a little height to it. So I definitely recommend you uh, picking through your hair to give it more volume. And then after I gave it more volume, I just shake and I go. And right now I am on day three and I can definitely to say that these products, when they say that they have a hole to them, they definitely do, especially the gel. However, because I said that I do have low porosity hair, I don't think that these products is for low porosity hair because after the product is dry, the next day I shook my head and I still, I have product buildup. And so with low porosity and high, por there's two different types of porosities you can have with your hair. There's low and there's high, I have low. If you'd like for me to make a separate video on that, I can share a little bit of the knowledge that I do know when it comes to that. But definitely making sure you pick out products that work with your hair is key. But other than that, I love how defined my curls look. I love how, actually the products smell absolutely amazing. I'm going to put all of Lotta Body's information down in the description box below. If y'all would like for me to do more natural hair videos, let me know. I feel like I do so many protective styles that I never really show my natural hair because when I take it out, I'm always putting something back in. So let me know if y'all would like more videos like that. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you could please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video.